songs in the key of C sharp minor and it starts with this chord so you just play the chord four times okay so the low E string is the first string two is B the third string is G D A and E which is the sixth string okay after you have strummed the chord four times, you just pluck the third, fourth, and fifth string, and then play uh, uh, the second string without your middle finger. Okay, so it is. So your you, your your first finger is actually barring the fourth fret. So it's. And now place your middle finger in the chord position, and and play it. And again, remove your finger and play it. Okay. okay. And you play that twice. And now, the third time what you do is, place your middle finger, plug the bottom three strings of the chord, and then play the second string. So it's actually the reverse of what we were doing in the beginning. So you play this way and then do a pull off, which is you play the second string again, and while it's ringing, you have to remove your middle finger off. You can either do a hammer on or uh, or play the note when you when you have to do this. Play the third, fourth, and fifth string. Plug them, and then play the second string with your middle finger on. And then do and then play it again and do a pull off. And then again play it back. So it's going to be like. So I'll do it just slowly, and you can. Okay. So until here we have got okay. And now what you do is you play the low E string, which is the sixth string, and the bottom three strings, which are actually the first, second and third. The, the next chord is uh, the F sharp minor chord. Uh, place your middle finger on the second fret of the low E string, which is the sixth string, and your ring finger on the first string, second fret. And you're again going to do the same thing that we did over here. So you do a pull off and a hammer on. Okay. You got it? And now we play you can you, you can play a B major chord. Actually I personally find the B seventh chord to sound more uh, beautiful in this context. So th that's what I do. So what you do is play the fifth string, which is the B note, bass note, and then the second, third and fourth string together. The last part is place your fourth finger on the fourth fret of the fifth string which is the C sharp bass note and your middle finger on this um, D sharp note on your second string. So if you can see it, yeah, play the bass note and play the second string with your ring finger on fifth fret. And then ring finger off the fret, so you're actually holding the fourth fret with your middle finger now. 
and then just bring the whole position one whole step downward and play the B string which is the second string without your middle finger and then you play the fifth fourth and third string of the A major chord And then the song kicks in. Yeah, thank you very much for watching. Uh, I hope that helps. If you would like to uh, learn the entire song, stay tuned and subscribe to my channel. I will be um, posting a tutorial for the whole song. So you can play the intro and sing the song and impress um, uh, whoever you want to. Thank you very much for watching and um, uh, if you liked it, make sure you hit the like button, share it with your friends. If you have any requests, uh, please let me know in the comments. Uh, section. Keep up the great work. I'll see you in my next video. Until then, bye. What else do I have to say? Um, I'll see you in my next video.